Hey folks, David Fine here from Keys Maws. I got Ricky in the back. I got Brant. And guys, Ricky and Brant are witnessing me on my stomach on a on a concrete path in the Florida Keys. And guys, what would possess me to, to get down on my hands and knees, on my stomach, with bugs crawling all over me? There's only there's only a couple things that I can think of that would get make me get on my hands and knees. And guys. This right here is one of them. This is one of the rarest moths that, that we've encountered in the Florida Keys. This is Eumorpha vitis, the vine sphinx. And guys, I'm gonna tell you all about this. This is only the second one I have ever seen in the Florida Keys, and we're gonna show you all about it. Brant, you excited about this, buddy? I'll tell you what, anytime I see you go to your belly for something, I know it's important. <laughs> I don't know exactly what the importance of that is, but you on your belly says it all. Well, I never seen him doing that. So yeah, so Rick, says, Ricky's never seen me on my belly. We've done this a few times. Yeah, so he's done it more than me, but man, I tell you what, Dave on his belly, that's the excitement level I've never seen. I, this, this is another level of excitement. Guys, all right, let's get to the video on the Vine Sphinx. Okay, guys, after a brief hiatus of looking for caterpillars, uh, we came back to my light sheet and we found this beautiful, beautiful Eumorpha vitis. The Vine Sphinx, guys. This is only the second time that I've ever seen this moth in the state of Florida. Uh, this is a beautiful, beautiful, fresh specimen. How amazing is that, guys? And I am so excited because um, this moth right here, guys, is, uh, it's, it's super rare. Let me see if I can, I gotta take a picture here real quick. Let me see if I can. I'm getting good photos of this, guys. All right, this this moth is is very rare, guys. It's part of the Eumorpha group, and it's a it's a moth that feeds on grape, but for whatever reason, we don't we don't see many of them, and I don't, I don't know why it is. I don't know why they're not more common, uh, but this is an incredible moth right here, guys. Uh, there's one that's pretty similar called the Banded Sphinx. It's got these bands on the forewings like this, but the hind wing, I'm gonna try and show you. Oh, there it is, guys, look at that. The hind wing on this one has no pink, whereas the, the hind wing on the, on the banded sphinx has this really beautiful pink coloration, guys. Um, this is an incredible tropical moth that I've seen them several times in Costa Rica only one time ever in the state of Florida. And uh, guys, this this is a day that I'm super happy about because this moth is absolutely stunning. And uh, what an amazing moth right here, guys. Eumorpha vitis. There's also several other Eumorpha species in, um, in the state of Florida, in the Florida Keys. We have Eumorpha, um, Fasciatus, which is the, the the banded sphinx, which which feeds on primrose, which we have up in the um, in the mainland more. I found a couple of them down here, but their host plant does not live here. Um, we have Eumorpha. Uh, fa, um, <laughs> we have Eumorpha. Um, my gosh, we have Eumorpha lubresca, the gaudy sphinx. Uh, that's the big green one. Um, obviously he's not, we're not confusing that one here. And then there's Pandora and there's Ackerman. There's a couple other, uh, Eumorpha species that live here guys, but, um, we're not confusing them either. Uh, guys, this is a special moment for me. Cause I, out of 20 years of moth collecting in South Florida, this is the only, this is actually the only one I've ever seen alive. The other one that I found was in a bucket light trap. So. Um, I'm just, I'm just soaking this in guys. I'm soaking this in. It's, I'm, I don't want to mess with it because I don't want it to fly away. Um, what an incredible moth. I love how it has this like, this pattern on the thorax. It looks like a saddle. And I've got this real strong, real strong muscular 
uh, body, guys. It's a very fast flyer. If you've ever seen uh, a Sphinx moth in flight, this one is a fast, fast moth. And I, I've actually never seen this one. I've seen ones in the same family in flight. And, it, you know, they're flying. They're zooming by. You can barely see them as they go by. Um, I can only imagine what this guy would look like flying by. Uh, as far as flowers go, uh, we believe they go to flowers. I've never seen one at a flower before, uh, but they probably, like other Eumorpha um, moth species, will, will go to certain flower spe uh, types and, and, uh, and take nectar from those. Um, caterpillars are green. They've got these big kind of like eye spots or we're, we're like a, they've got these big colorations on the uh, sphericals that go down the side of the caterpillar. But guys, I'm super excited about this. And my gosh, I'm excited. I'm excited. Have I mentioned I'm excited? I've mentioned I'm excited. Wow. This moth right here makes my night, guys. It, it makes the whole trip. Drive, driving all the way down to the Keys, setting all this stuff up. You know, we found some other moths, which are cool. But this one makes the whole trip worth it. And, you know, I'm just a, I'm just a happy man. So, um, guys, hope you liked the video on the Vine Sphinx. I'm sure we're going to find more stuff. But I, I figured that this moth deserved its own video. And, um, you know, check out some of our other videos. We've got plenty of other stuff. Uh, that we're going to find here on this trip to the Florida Keys. For instance, there's a Melopotis right here. There is a um, Notodonid right there. There is another Sphinx species. That's a Protambulix stragilis. And that's just what I can see. I'm like laying down on my stomach, trying to get you guys the best possible footage of this moth that I can. And um, I'm going to give you one last view of the Vine Sphinx before I end the video. Give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Till next time, guys, um, let's get out there and enjoy our time in the Florida Keys and South Florida. Let's find some cool bugs like Eumorpha vitis.